Dun, 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 dun. Players are in place. Serious time. Adam C. Chris B. Quan, no initial. All right, so now that we've seen the status of the players, we've seen legitimately the order in which they actually placed. We're sort of etch-a-sketching those uh, scores away because right now it's every person for themselves. Everybody starting again fresh with a clean slate. Do keep in mind, though, if you just want to, like, just know the one who did score the highest score previously was Quan. So he would be what we would call the favorite going into this. <laughs> All right, so these uh, four players are playing for the top two to move on. Gun is up on your mark. Get set. Go. All right, gun has been fired. Everybody's ready. Starting over. Do over. Super Mario Brothers first player to 50 gets to move on to Rad Racers, dude. All right, Adam's moving now. All right, great job. All right, everybody's jumping, everybody's hopping, everybody's doing what they're supposed to do. First in the tunnel is Chris, followed quickly by, by Quan, and Adam's down there grabbing some coins. Right now, man, this is too close to call. 21, 21, 21. Jump Street, everybody's got 21 coming out of the hole, and we're moving on here. And boom, Adam. Adam got pounced. So did Quan, so did Chris. Only person who didn't was Steven. Steven's got the flag, but you know what? Despite getting there, it looks like still uh, Chris and Quan have higher scores than uh, than uh, than uh, Steven did. All right, so right now, again, getting the 50, we have three players that are tied at 36, and Steven just, you know, hanging out, saying hello, saying hello to some folks. 37, 37, 37 for a while there, and now we're moving on. We got 45 at the top there with Quan. 47, but for Quan and Chris. A lot of jumping going on. Adam saying, hey, look, look, I'm not out of this, folks. 50 with Chris. Chris is moving on to Rad Racers, and so is Quan. So both of them are going to be getting in the start in cars. They're going to be starting up. They're going to be putting the pedals to the metal around the same time. Boom, Adam. He may have been last before, but Adam is in this right now, getting in his car, bundling up his seatbelt, checking in the rearview mirror, make sure he's got gas in the tank. Do you have insurance? It doesn't matter. <laughs> All right, so we've got three players on the move right now. Steven now in the car going, hey, wait a minute, where to put my keys? Hun, where's the keys? No, Steven is moving now too. All players, all players are moving. And uh, again, the person that we just, I guess, ceremoniously said our, uh, our our leader from the previous round, Quan, is uh, kind of in the lead right now. Yes, he is. He's in the lead right now. Slightly, slight lead. Not a big lead. Slight lead. Chris, Adam, right on his tail. Right on his tail. Now, Adam, a little bit of traffic problem. Boom! Chris! Knocked out for a second here, flipped over, getting back on the road. Every time he gets hit, slows it down a little bit, puts you in a, uh, a little bit uh, further behind everyone else. And uh, lo and behold, first, folks, Quan still maintaining that commanding lead, but like coming up second because of that uh, flip by Chris is Adam. Way to go, Adam. Steven, Steven's still like uh, taking pictures on Hollywood Boulevard. Steven, get in that car, drive, stop looking at the tourists, go, Steve, go. Got to catch up because Quan and Adam are making their way to the goal. And right now, it looks like, wow, it looks like neck and neck Quan and Adam and neck and neck Chris and Steven. All right, so we're taking a look here. Oh, my gosh, Chris again. Another mishap. Somebody rear in him, and he did not get the license plate number. That's going to slow him down. Quan, though. Making his way to the goal. It's coming up, folks. It's going to be there in a second. And he's going to get a jump on Tetris. But you know what? Oh, wait. I spoke too soon. A little backwards flip there by Quan. And he bounced over the goal line. So he's still going on first. Quan heading on the Tetris. Starting it up right now. I don't know what Adam's doing there. He's doing a Tokyo Drift. Adam, you got to go forward. There you go. Adam now getting ready to build some bricks here. We're not talking Lego. We're talking Tetris. All right, so now Quan knows what to do. We've seen him in action before. And, um, you know, uh, he's, he's building up as fast as he can, trying to get that score as high as he can. Steven now has joined the party. Chris finally made his way over to Russia, playing a little Tetris with the rest of us. 
I have no idea what Adam's doing there. Adam's going like, does it look, look pretty? Adam, hey, do you want to build a snowman? No, you got to build the stacks. You got to make them fall. He's got a couple of big holes there, Adam. I don't know what's going on over there. But look, Quan, bam, showing us that he knows what to do. Nice couple of moves there by Quan. We're still looking at right now what's going on. What was going on is, it's, it's Quan out by a mile here. You can see the scores. I'm not going to waste talking numbers. Use your eyeballs. Quan is whooping them. Whooping them good here. We're at about a minute and uh, 45 seconds left to go. The only person that's near him right now is Adam. And that's really hard to, to believe because Adam's things look kind of weird. Uh, but you know what? If Steven can get some good moves, maybe get a couple of Tetrises. And look at uh, look at Chris there. If we can find something to fill up that middle there, maybe he can like put a dent in the clinic that Quan is doing. Again, another blinkly blink of the boxes making them fall down. We're looking at Quan just kind of going, do you like me now? Yes, we do. But the other players, they've got to figure out how to catch up. They've got to make a move here. Another weird little bridge thing blocking there by Adam. Quan, you know, basically we're just waiting to see who's going to come in second. Because it's all day long. Quan, bam, Steven got himself a Tetris right there. Way to go to pull that one off there. Pulled that out of utility belt from nowhere. That was really a great move here. And all of a sudden, just like that, just like that, Steven jumped into the lead, folks. No, he didn't. Yes, he did. Yes, he did. Steven jumped into the lead. Snuck up real quick there with a couple of back-to-back -back boom shakalakas. But not to beat him now. Okay, look. All of a sudden, all of a sudden, it's Quan and Steven back and forth. They're trading blows like two boxers. It looks like Quan, no, said, uh-uh, no. I'm going to suck a punch you. I'm going to hit you low. You're going to fall down. You're going to take a 10-second count, and he's going to keep going on because Quan right now said, uh-uh, not in my house. He's shaking that Matenda Matumbo finger going, uh-uh-uh. You didn't say the magic word. That's Jurassic Park, baby. That's right. I'm uh, I'm mixing all kinds of references here. <laughs> but Quan, Quan is doing it. Ten seconds left in the game. Ten seconds left in the game. So basically, it's the battle for second place because it looks like right now, unless there's something crazy, Quan's going. We got three seconds. We got two seconds. One second. Time is up, folks. That was a great round. Great round, Quan. Quan. Woo! Juan and Steven. Who would have thought? All right, the gun is in hand. It's up in the air. We've got Quan. We've got Steven. Two players. One moves on. One moves to Washington. On your mark. Get set. Go. All right. Both players are gone. We're back at the round in which they have to get 50 points. I really do want this Robin over here. He's got the cape and everything. <laughs> All right. And they're both off. Jumping, finding the right hole to go down. Trying to feel. All right, Quan managed to get in there. Steven got a little tripped up. Used to tie his shoelaces. Messed up a little bit there. Giving Quan the slight advantage. But they both come out of the hole with 21 each. So that's all that matters. Do you have the. Oh! Both of them got pounced. Keeping it even at 22 apiece. Time is ticking. Both guys are at the exact same place a while ago, but now somehow Quan managed to grab a couple extra coins. He picked someone's pocket, pulled down a lead. That was so rude. All right. All right, Quan is about to take the lead. Quan is in the lead. Quan's about to get 50. One more, Quan. Hit that boom, boom, and it's done. Boom, almost simultaneously. Quan and Steven, almost simultaneously moving on. This is going to be great, folks. Both are going to get in the cars. Both are going to start their engines at the same time. They're both ahead down the track at the same time, trying to get to that goal, trying to get to the finish line. Not too often do we have players starting the race almost at the same time. And there we go. Bam. It's going to be a good one, folks. Looking at the speed right now. Both of them going way faster than you're supposed to drive on the 101. <laughs> All right, but they're moving. All right, oh, looks like Steven got a little uh, little distracted there by the traffic. Juan managed to maneuver around it without barely slowing down. Did not tap that brake. But as I look at the uh, look at the uh, meter there, both of them still seem to be neck and neck. This is going to be a tight one. The reason why they're number one and number two is because they're both very good at this. Steven hitting the brakes for him and he had to pump that brake. Quan did too. He had to maneuver around a car. 
But they're both moving. Oh, watch out for the car. Steven doing a great job. Got around that car. Oh, he hit the sign. That's going to cost him some time. And as he gets back on the road, Quan is waving in the rear view mirror going bye-bye. That's okay. Quan can hit an obstacle. Quan can hit a sign. Quan can have a problem with a car. And just like that, Steven is neck and neck with him again. But right now, where it stands, we're looking at Quan with a small lead in front of Steven. But it's not about, it's not just about getting to the goal first. It's about getting those points when we get to Tetris. But getting to the goal first gives you the opportunity to get started on building. So you will have a slight advantage if you get to the goal first. And right now, Quan knows all about it. Because Quan's going to get to that goal first, providing Quan does not have any mishaps along the way in these final moments of this rad race. All right, so Quan's doing a great job. Steven holding his own, staying right there. Not quite neck and neck. Definitely, definitely. Oh, and guess what I talked about? Quan slipped up, fell to the side, bounced over to the finish line. So really, that little mistake did not cause him any problems at all because he's moving on to Tetris. Meanwhile, Steven, he's stopping at a rest stop. Steven's got to pee. He's got to go to the rest stop. He's trying to get to the goal because Quan has already started building. Steven's still trying to get there. Steven, where are you? There you go. Steven made it there. Finally, Steven, get out of the car. Grab your bricks. Start building. Now, right now, Steve should be strategizing. It's about building, getting those Tetrises, making smart moves, not building bridges, not building crazy holes that jack you up. It's about trying to get those score, that score as high as you possibly can because he's got some serious catching up to do. But it can be done if the right moves are made. And that right there, that was a good move. That was a smooth move. All right, but right now, you can see what Kwan is trying for. Kwan gets the right piece. Bam! Piece the resistance. He got a Tetris right there. Folks, we're coming up now on the two minute mark two minute mark oh my gosh so all right i'm about to say what are you doing there steven steven you gotta watch what you do here because kwan bam whoop there it is he did it again another tetris kwan is just pulling way out ahead now kwan has got a commanding lead bam three right there i witnessed three tetrises by kwan and steven about to make his first Bam! There he is. Great job, Steve. You knew what you had to do. Now do it about 15 more times, Steven, because you got to catch up with Quan, who is like walking away with this thing. But Steven, I feel for you, man. I feel that you can do it. Come on, Steven. Do you want to build a snowman? Well, you got to get down there and get some Tetris. There you go. There you got another one right there. Now it looks like Quan might be in a little trouble. No, there's no trouble with Quan. He knows what he's doing. Boom, shakalaka. He cleared the path, got another Tetris. Steven, on the other hand, is going, look at the pretty colors. Come on, Steven. You got to get it down there. You got to get it in there right. We are coming up now to the final moments. Folks, believe it or not, we are now at just 60 seconds left. Steven pulling off a nice move right there. But, folks, we're counting down. We're under a minute now. And the way the score looks right now, wow. It can be done. Steven, it can be done. I'm going to say it. It can be done. Oh, Steven, he pulled ahead. Oh, my gosh, what a hat track. Steven pulled ahead last minute. Boom, he's taking it to the next level. He's got more than 5,000 in front of uh, Quan right now. Steven doing something here. Miracles do happen, folks. Miracles do happen because right now, Steven listened to all of the crap I was saying and said, no, I will show you how to play this game. Steven, bam, got another Tetris. Steven is behind now. Quan said, I will not be denied. We will not go without a fight. We're at 20 seconds. We will not go down without a fight. This is Steven's Independence Day. This is Quan's Independence Day. Right now, Steven is in his back. 10 seconds next. We're at 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Steven's done it. Steven's done it. Wow. Wow. Steven's coming from behind. Steven breaking it down. Steven, a.k.a. the Stealth Bomber. Way to go, Steven. Quan, doing a great job. Squan, our leader going into this, putting on a clinic for us. Steven showing he knows how to get it done, too. How about a big round of applause for both of these massively cool competitors up here?